home And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my thoughts keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out How's it going lads, Marshall here and welcome to this kind of little chilled commentary for myself, it's not anything serious, I just want to get your opinions on a few things like what you want to see from me in the future on FIFA 14, it'll be my first full year on Ultimate Team, on FIFA, in YouTube sense anyways, I've been on FIFA since, since I can remember, since I think it was FIFA 97 when you had indoor football, man that was the fucking shit, that was amazing, but then I turned to Pez and then went back to FIFA, but anyways, cracking on, I'm off topic already, I just want to get your thoughts on what you want to see from me on FIFA 14, what's happening with my current series, uh, the wages to Ronaldo, and stuff like that, what you want to catch on, what you want to see in the future, and just get your thoughts in the comment section below, really, so... Like I said, what do you want to see from me on FIFA 14? At the minute I've got my inform analysis, which I will be continuing. Do you want to see player reviews on non-informs when the first game comes out? Like player IDs kind of things? Stuff like that. I will be looking to improve that series by the way. New graphics, new ways I go about doing it and stuff like that. I just want to generally improve everything I do to get the best quality out to you guys. That's what I've generally doing anyways, trying to get the best quality out to you guys full stop but I will continue that on the FIFA 14 I've got the road to redemption or I've done the road to redemption I've done the road to Rio I've done the road to perfection next stop I will be going for a different nation I don't know which nation to do yet but I will be continuing that the wager series that's a bit a bit dodgy to start FIFA 14 with wages straight away, but I will be looking to do wages at some point, so let us know if that is a good idea. Pink slips, perhaps. I've got vlogs that I could do. I've just got all sorts. The possibilities are endless, really, with FIFA 14, so let me know what you want to see. Career mode, for me, that's, that's a bit weird, because I don't like playing the CPU, because on Legendary, they seem to bloody anticipate everything you do. It's like the psychics. Yes, I know it's a game engine, but Jesus Christ, let them have a few mistakes sometimes. And uh, yeah, that does get on my goat when I'm playing career mode or against the computer. But I will give that a shot if you guys want to see it. Because I do end up enjoying everything I do. Because what's the point in going half-hearted at things? I mean, that's what I did with YouTube. I went out and bought an HD PVR straight away. I'm not going to start at the bottom get a, like a Roxio or something low standard. I just want to go out and get the best quality to bring to you guys. I got this... Snowball mic, I think it is, and um, yeah, it's a good quality mic. I like the mic since I had I was using my headset ages ago, but now I'm on the blue snowball, and it's a lot easier to use. It's a lot more practical than having a headset wrapped around your head, wires everywhere. And um, yeah, I'm off topic already, but uh, <laughs> I've covered basically what you want to guys see on FIFA 14. My current series wages to team of the season Ronaldo that will be ending soon, it will be ending on the 13th. That will be when. The giveaway, if I do get them by the way, will take place and I don't know what to do if I don't get them. Like, I might have such amount of coins. I haven't even finished recording the series yet. I haven't played all the wages. I've got some big ones coming up. But do you want me to give away those coins? Pink slip the coins? Pink slip the player? I really don't know how to end the series but I think it will be with a giveaway on Friday the 13th. It's unlucky for some, but like I said in the last episode, I think it was, it could be lucky for one of you guys. Now, Two improvements. What do you want to see me improve? Do you want to see more stuff like this where I interact with you guys, get your thoughts on what's happening? I know I did a mistake in one of my current uh, inform analysis. Well, it's part of the panel. That was a new feature I did just trying out towards the end of um, FIFA 13 where you could click on any player and basically give you early access to their reviews. Just stuff like that. I could do pack openings. I could just do all sorts. Like I said, the possibilities are endless. Now, what I want to talk about is the web app as well. I'm shite at trading, but do you want to see me record the web app? I can do that, even though, like I said, I am terrible at trading, but I can learn as I go along, kind of um, dummies trading or whatever it is. I don't even know what those books are called. I think it's dummies guide. I had dummies guide to trading. I could do something like that. And um, yeah, I won that game by the way in the background, it was a pretty easy win in the end, I did dominate the game, I beat him by 2 goals to 1, walked the, uh, walked the division even with that squad, it was a cracking squad, so thank you very much to the follower on Twitter, at Marshall89HD, who gave me that squad, it was a cracking squad, I walked the division, 7 wins to 1 defeat, 
And as you all know, you get this pack at the end. I've never ever on this game received anything good in this pack that you get for winning Division 1. Honestly, never. Let me know in the comment section below if you've actually had a good player in this pack. I think it's a myth. I only got contracts and a player fitness, which is always... Always good. I like the fitness cards, especially when you get the team ones like that. The rest of the pack is just shite. But um, I think I'll wrap this episode. Episode, I don't... It's not even an episode. Just this random commentary. I could bring these in the future as well, by the way, if you want me to interact with you more often. Get your thoughts on certain subjects, on certain things. And let me know your thoughts on the points I've touched on in this video. And I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you all next time.